A day after the Hawks' first round exit in the NBA playoffs, they came back to their training facility on Wednesday morning for exit interviews, marking the official end of the 2021-2022 season for this team. And what a season it was, filled with ups and downs. Trey Young describing it as a roller coaster. Now that the season is over, they've had a chance to reflect on the season that was. I think this team fought hard and, and proud of this team, the way we, we battled through adversity all year. And so, um, obviously, the season ended lower than what we did last year, but. I still think there were some high moments throughout the year. We had so many guys banged up going into this year. We had a shortened off season, 10 weeks. We just we didn't start the way we needed to. And again, a lot of that had to do with injuries and banged up, but our focus level wasn't there. All of a sudden, we get hit by COVID. It just really felt like all year it was, you know, we were just one step behind. We were a little just one step slow. We were able to overcome that and get ourselves into the playoffs. I think with how far we went last year, expectations went high. We have to put this year uh, behind us, learn from it. We have to improve. I feel like step number one is avoid the plan. Do what's necessary in the, in the regular season and try to prepare for the postseason. Number two, just to stay together. You know how important togetherness is for us, regardless if we have the same team. It's, you know there must be a certain level of camaraderie, togetherness for us to succeed. So naturally the question in everybody's mind is what will this Hawks team look like going forward? We met with general manager Travis Slink, who said that because of the contract situations, this team will be more aggressive this offseason than they were the last. Cover the Hawks outside the training facility. I'm Reggie Chapman, 11 Live Sports.